Hi, this is a demonstration of DC motor speed control by GSM. So this system uh, demonstrates the ability to control the DC motor over the uh, GSM or through SMS messages. So this makes it a very long range system where people or the user can operate uh, the motor from very large distances no matter where they are. So this is uh, very useful in industrial areas or uh, in terms of machinery where the machinery can be controlled from anywhere in the world so now in this system as you can see we have a dc motor which is connected to the circuit here the circuit uh, consists of uh, atmega microcontroller and the microcontroller is in turn interfaced with an lc display and uh, also a gsm modem and we have a push button for reset uh, and uh, motor driver ic and along with that uh, we also have powered this system with a 12 volt supply so now let's uh, see how the system works so whenever we uh, reset it so the system uh, is now running so now let's uh, do a thing let's give a call on the sim number that we have inserted in the modem so when we uh, give a call on this number the number from which we call is registered as the as the number or the official authorized number for the system so it will only uh, receive commands from this particular number and if uh, it gets commands from any other number it won't uh, you know pay, operate as per those commands so as you can see we have got a confirmation message that our number has been registered so now let's do one thing let's uh, give a message to start the motor so here we can uh, control the speed as well as the direction of the motor so we can uh, you know first uh, send a start message to start the motor So as you can see, we uh, send the message and the motor started. So now the motor has uh, started in forward direction at 100% uh, speed. So what we can do is we can also lower the speed by you know sending the forward command, the direction command along with uh, the speed after a space. So now let's uh, operate it at 50% uh, speed in the forward direction. So this is the command that we use. So now let's wait for the message to be received here. So the message is received and as you can see the speed has changed to 50% on receiving uh, it. So we can also you know change the direction. So now let's do one thing let's uh, stop it by sending the stop command. As you can see, as soon as the command was received, it stopped the motor. So now let's do a thing. Let's try the other direction. So now let's uh, try the backward direction with 20% uh, speed. And let's see what happens. So now as you can see as soon as the command was received it has now started the motor in backward direction at 20% efficiency. So this is how the system works. Thank you.